In this clip, we'll continue working with the Surface Painter tool. Let's pick a surface material and hover with the Surface Painter tool above the wall. The appearing tracker will display the following information. The preview icon and name of the existing and the new surface materials. The part of the element that the new surface material will be applied to. In the case of this wall, it can either be outside face or inside face. By moving the Surface Painter tool above the edge of the wall, the All Edges, and by pressing the Tab key on the keyboard, the All Faces option will appear in the tracker. By keeping the Surface Painter tool above the specified part of an element, ARCHICAD will show what it would look like with the new surface material applied. If you're satisfied with the result, just click to apply the surface material to the chosen part. When an element has multiple faces with the same surface material, another option is shown in the tracker. It's called All Similar Faces. If you apply the surface painter at this point, the result will be that all faces having the same surface material will be changed to the new surface material. If you choose a surface material from the palette that's not part of the project, the Surface Painter tool will remain inactive. First, you have to add this material to your project in order to use it by clicking on the Add to Project button. Then it can be used for painting. Another nice feature of Surface Painter is that you have direct access to the settings of a given surface material by simply double-clicking on it. Here's how to change the surface material of multiple elements at once that have the same surface material assigned. Let's say we want to switch the white color to green. First, select the white surface material on the palette. Then, use the Select All Elements Using Paint command from the menu. All elements with white on any of their faces will be selected. A faster approach to the same step is the following. Activate the eyedropper tool and click on a white surface. The white surface material will be selected in the Surface Painter palette. Now, right-click and use the Select All Elements Using Paint command from the Context menu. At this point, you can deselect those elements you don't want to change. To do this, first press the Escape key on the keyboard to exit the paint mode. Then deselect one of the morph objects by clicking on its corner. Now, Select the new surface material to be applied and paint over the white color in the right side column of the palette. An extra feature of the Surface Painter is the Remove All Surface Overrides command. In order to use this command, first select some elements and then issue the command. All surface override materials will be removed from the selected elements.